Welcome back to my channel. What's up? What's up, people? What's up, people? My my hair is not in its best mood today, so I'm wearing a hoodie to kind of hide it. So I have said on my New Year's resolution video, which will be on the description box below, that. I want more organization in my life and what better way to organize your life than to make your very own DIY infinity calendar you can put everything that you need to do all of your schedule for the month and you can use it for a very long time so I have started th doing this this January 2017 and I want to show you guys how I made this DIY infinity calendar don't forget to put a thumbs up if you like more DIY videos and subscribe as well because I upload videos every single week so without further ado let's get started let's do this so to make your very own infinity calendar all you need are some markers some papers, I used seven papers for this, a picture frame, and some scissors. So the first thing I did was to remove the paper inside of the frame so that I can measure the length and the width so that I can divide it into seven columns and five rows. So here I just got a ruler to measure the length and the width of the paper so that I can have an accurate size for my squares. I just want some accuracy so I'm using my phone to divide the length which is 28.5 centimeters by 7. So each square should have 4.07 centimeters on its side. Next thing I did was to cut around 2 inches of paper and then cut the 4 centimeter square from there. And then I outlined the paper that I have just cut to have a better look on how the spacing should be. Then I used these papers to use as a guide to cut my other colored paper. And here I have 7 different colored papers arranged like a calendar. I decided to put black paper as the background for my colored paper so that they pop out. So here's what it looks like. I just used white paper so that I can clearly see what month it is. So right here, I'm just putting my almost finished calendar into the frame to finish everything up. So now that I have my calendar in the frame, it is now time to write the days and the months using my colored pens. So I am using green to write the month January and 17. And I'm using blue to write Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, and Saturday. I want this calendar to be as colorful as possible. And here I'm just using black to write the days of the calendar. And voila! There you have it! Now I'm gonna write my schedule for January. So this is my infinity calendar. Don't forget to tag me when you make your own calendar as well. Thanks for watching guys. Love ya! So that is it for my DIY infinity calendar. I hope you had fun watching. If you have any questions, comment down below and I will try to answer them. And yes, thanks for watching. I will see you on the next video. Bye!